What's up, world? Hey, here Washington. We over here at Fresh Start 3 for the two-year anniversary. Washington, make some noise. Yeah. This is the main event on my left, you got. Young Night Money Gang Porter, we in the building, Dirt Out Clothing, you know what it is. My boy from Urban Rain, I'm saying a few words. Yeah. Hey, what up, man? It's Mr. Rambo, repping Urban Rain. When it's sunny outside, we still wear it, man. What it do? Yeah. What do you want to do? What up? It's Jimmy A.B.M., man. R.I.P. Shady, man. Let's get this battle cracking, man. Let's go. Yeah. Now, we're on my left. Introduce yourself. Oh, oh is that is good. Everybody shut the fuck up and watch battles. Like, stop talking. Be polite and respectful to everybody performing. Yeah. Uh, no evidence, RP safe, ABL. That is good. She don't play no shit. The game is getting in. <laughs> hey. On my right, we got. Hey, man, you know what it is. Cam's doing the rap tour. Free line of baby all day. Hey, and to my right is the entrepreneur, the entrepreneur from the West. <laughs> you already know what it is. Bad trend, jerk out the clothing. You know the song. If it ain't a clean mouth, it's a bad mouth. We just get a quick long assignment for all the fucking rappers. That way, I'm gonna send everybody real quick. And a bad one to my right. Introduce yourself. You are not a top tier, you a bitch. Oh dear. R.I.P. Sonora. This comes out of here to you. Hey, since you're on my way, you're going to call it in here. Hey! Round one, on King Hustle, maybe this. I said, I got hands like eight deep, but I don't detail cars. Out there is good. You punch the teeth into the back of your mouth. I hope your dead is good. Cause your name rings liberty bells. I hear it and want to put a crack on it. And put your brain out the back of your skull. And make you think back on it. Woo! Fuck! And feel bad, don't it? But a spare car will knock off your brains. I'll leave your brain splattered on the floor. Now I gotta drive down memory lane. And I'll pull your guts out your mouth. Like when you gotta pull your socks inside out. I got four in the damn with you. That's the 18. But you'll get eight if I pull this nine out. Get it? The 18, 18, you'll get eight if I pull this nine out? Tell them, pull your spine out. And my goons don't pull up, they fly down, pop up, and dive out. You'll die now. Cause if I feel one shred of hate, the punches connect like Lucent's eyebrow. <laughs> Sound like click, click, bang, 
Osama meets Obama. Ask your mama. I got the llama and I'm a bomb shit. Saddam shit. I'm not gonna shoot shit up and turn your mind state into a province. Just ask this motherfucking squad, I lost you. But today, I'm gonna throw you in the dryer. Since the tent got air holes, I'm gonna make this bitch vanish. I have this chink bitch screaming in Spanish. And I ain't talking about my sneakers when I say we gonna have an air tent challenge. And I'm spazzing right now. I'll show them how great work. And they had y'all already know my slogan. Great work! You're fat. <laughs> this is the fact. This match would have been his ass. Since I've seen him lose every battle, y'all must want me here to give him the worst ass whipping he's had. Just, I got a question to ask. How do you give a roundup to this fat ass, whack ass man, this Spanish ass bitch, you fat ass? Whack ass, non-rapping ass bitch, this faggot ass bitch always catching backlash Cause he's crying like a skank ass emotion, having ass bitch, good god, god damn, I'm back to punching Crack the substance on it fam, stop the skin, you working hard or already working You got a problem fam, it's lots of shims, this battle would don't matter if he's sick or he's swimming He's still gon' sleep with the fish like Aquaman, let's start the plot of planet Okay How you constantly run your mouth since you unveiled your dreams Can't stop talking about what he's doing or done like there's something we can't really see. Don't talk about it, be about it. It's a bad look, for real. I mean, I'm the weapon, so I'm never rapping the rag to reveal my scene. But he is a sloppy, fat, Hispanic cat, so it makes sense. He'll always spill the beans. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't big, he was small. Yeah. You kill him, he's proving his ass. His crime got more severe as he stepped on the stage. It's just fits and gimmicks and rages. Funny as he got older, his ability to whine got it better with. Hey, you remember that day when you snuck Mike, caught him with the right, like you was good at your hands and make them to hit in your car like the tension would have passed till hypnosis ran up to the whip, posted us and shook up ass on the tough talk out the window. Hush tried to book it fast, hit the book and ran up to the whip, told Hush to shoot the fair one. Otherwise, he whooped his ass, Hush's pussy ass was rattled, got up the car, listened, punched, hooked him dead, and it's crazy. I'm just a Hush, like a chip check, his mouth good That's fucking fast. But, uh, let's, that is, uh, you didn't get out of the So, Scratcher, let's just go with the flow of the plot. Perhaps you could just change the role in your job. Maybe you could just patrol with the cop because you already carry Mason and look like he don't us a lot. I mean, woo. already looks like he don't us a lot. But you know what's funny? How we always be talking about weapons? In his battle, like the street, watch this show against Adam and I'm paraphrasing. He said, I got a Glock so old, I shot it in BC and used it to kill AD. Stop it. Well, yeah, the concept was fucked, but motherfucker, that's impossible. So now we know, uh, well, no, that, that, that we get rapping. See, if you use reaches as a concept, that proves you will reach a place where you can see it's average. Exaggerate retarded punches with the long arms to show you have a reach advantage, and he always got some excuse. Why lose? I eat. Remember, high noon hush was all like, sorry y'all, I got fucked up the night before. Otherwise, I would have had a homie cut. It was all the Molly Club. Ironic, y'all popping on and on with all that MDMAs. Why you got Molly Walk? I'm countless, countless okay. fucking bullshit. Okay. Since your ugly, fat fucking face reared on our scene. Like, how you a pioneer on our scene, but make us look bad for years and some seeds. It's only lies I hear when you speak. I heard you bragging about Hollywood and you got gangster cousins because you know Salvadorians wear MS 13. No, I heard you got paid about bragging about coming up off league owners. But bragging about being paid when you appear on the scene, but you making money off us but are clearing the fees. I know how to make this King Hush. We throw King Hush in the box like King Tuck for the bigger than schemes. The way you act is practically a hood violation. Probably why your shit crazy. Always looking for a good time waiting. I get the good time shaking, so your bitch want my hood. And she would vibrate it. I mean, she kick it with this Marky Mark all the time, so of course she wants some good vibrations. I mean, this round, you show that your mouth got you in trouble every time that you spoke in the back and voice opinions and bitch. Besides when you rhyming and flowing, we find it below just the disguise, just in motion. So the moral of the story is hush, hush, and we shut the fuck up this time. It's gold. Make some more!
Alright, man, this man a big shit. Such a whore. You choked like 10 times in that last round. You were about to see a lot of gore when Hypnosis hit me up in that whip. He said, why did you race him? Did he try to rape you? What the fuck would I get out of the car for? <laughs> hey, oh my God, that last round was so overrated. You're misdirected, boy? PG-13. It was overrated. And y'all know what rhymes with overrated? I put the biscuit in his mouth and he overrated. Now I'ma send tummy shots at your abdomen just to make your stomach burn. I'll pull your intestines out your side, move them in and out of your ribcage, then tie a bow in the front. So you don't gotta see bloody guts to make your stomach turn. And I'll fuck your bitch good since you ain't doing it right. So let that bitch know, my dick get hard when the wind blow. I'll drive down and see a flash. Like traffic cops posted up at your window. He said I'm addicted to Molly. You fucking lie. Actually, you're right. <laughs> I'm addicted to Molly. I'll go cuckoo for coke and blunts. I swear, I'm never sober, y'all. But since you want to do that, I'm going to freestyle and put two straps on your shoulder blades. Like you're rocking a pair of overalls. Ooh. And now, you're going to I'm going to aim at your whole kick. But since they all done, that means only you get hit. And you didn't expect it coming into the ring with me, but you pops from fire. Because you done fell in some shit. Because Drake going solo got hands. But yet, got guns. So he don't have to fight. I got a gun so big, bullets will rip through time and hit everybody in the afterlife. I break down bricks like Mortal Kombat. And you, Sonya, I'm trying to test your might. And Demon will kill you slowly with a plane. That's right. So you better hope that Wesley snipes. And I get high off the smell of fear. And the trail leads to this soft shit. And you're so fucking pussy whipped right now. Every day you get your ass beat by a boss bitch. So when she yells at you, you just keep your fucking head down like an ostrich. And by the way, Dre Vicious, suck my dick. Cause I'm keeping clutch up in Seattle as a hostage. Hey, Fever camp. Hey, and you had the nerve to buy some bars. Where the camera? He had the nerve to buy some bars. I'm gonna throw it. He had the nerve to buy some bars. I'm talking about Think Friday. Nah, no, fuck that. Think good fellas. Cause you'll get beat with the gap. Matter of fact, you were right. Think Friday. Cause even little Chris got whipped with the strap. And what the fuck was you at? When I was trying to put Ahab Washington on the map, you was hating on me. Trying to sabotage me cause I tried to expose that you was whack. So go ahead, spit that savage trap. Oh, and don't forget to push your glasses back. But remember, I'll fuck your bitch on the way to shoot. Then drop her out the window like, here, you can have her back. Hey, I made her asshole snap. That booty made her pop sound like a snapple cat. One call on the iPhone, and I'ma lift it in the whip. That's an apple cat. Hey, bars. <laughs> and nobody understands your bars. They just listen, cheer, and say fuck that. You start spitting all this incredibly complicated shit, and other shit starts popping off on the side like hubcaps. And honestly, I only gave you that $200 because I seen a post where you said you was broke and had low self-esteem, and that's a lack of mental health. So I helped you out, because you gotta be a shitty ass person. Oh my bad, I'm gonna throw up. You gotta be a shitty ass person. I, I remember I'm gonna You gotta be a shitty ass person. Oh god, shit. You gotta be a shitty ass person to not fucking believe in yourself. And I'm spazzing right now. I'll show you how a great work and I'm really sick, but I'm still up here rapping like a pro, bitch. Slay it, boy. Give me that for that round, y'all. Punch stuck to homie when he was trying to watch MCs get ready. Then instead of shooting the fair one, you make 
Cause he didn't wanna see no tension Insecure motherfuckers like him needing weapons Cause he's an MC neglected So he's shipping the scenes presented to how he seeks attention You snuck Mike Phenom over internet beef projected Like talking it out man to man shouldn't be respected When you got Mike Phenom punched and maced And made me wait and pray that you got snuck up and sprayed When you least expect it And you know what's funny? Mike Phenom, he didn't even drop from the snuff out if that was me, my team would have had the bar looking like that one scene with The Rock in the rundown. And I know I used the fuck run against Nate off in that one round, but if you're gonna suffer punch someone, you should have at least knocked them the fuck out. I mean, maybe you just wasn't right at punching nights. I mean, even in your battles, you always punching like fucking right. You should have knocked them out fast. You're meaning to tell me you couldn't drop someone by sneaking them with your 400 pound ass? I mean, you, you would have fight to fought someone your size to do what have schooled you. You could learn how to throw a proper right or left hand watching YouTube or Google. You got top ramen punches. That means you was throwing oodles and noodles. And I mean, you got that mentality. You Like like John Mayer, a strap over the shoulder like a guitar player. And you think with that mindset, he throw a punch correctly. But you all play You're supposed to sneak him with that Ed, 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 Eddie style. Don't just kid around with it. They mouth with the jaw breaker. You know what's fucked up though? Mike Fina was the one who got most of her shots on King of the Dock. And on your behalf, you just gonna strike him fast and sneak him with no fighting chance. And Megan, after he tried to grant succeeding, well, it makes sense. He's fat, so of course he's gonna bite the hand that feeds him. Sneaking someone when they drinking is fucked up. It ain't hard. If I was getting drunk and someone got me snuck in and stuff, my clicks with the funk and it starts. You wouldn't even have the chance to run in your car. It's pole vaulting when my bro squabbing. That means you getting jumped at the bar and I know I got fucking pocket checks so hard by me. I'm not talking about being one of the truest motherfuckers. It's honestly one of the reasons why I toned down violence in all my battles. I don't think it's cool bragging about killing motherfuckers. I don't like you, and that's why people say I'm one of the illest up and comers. Cause I proved you ain't gotta shoot, you just gotta be true to yourself to be one of the realest motherfuckers. I don't like you, you're a bitch, you got that trick exterior. You're tough talk, but you punch off. This apparent, bruh. Seems like your mouth begins to wear on you when people see the real you filling out bitch criteria. So basically, he's like Akuma, not because he's fire, but because pushing the right buttons on this Street Fighter. Make some noise! Make some noise for yourself. There's a lot of bars going. Yeah, yeah, third round. Third round. I said, you are a bum. <laughs> and I honestly don't think that you're at all smart, because I wanted to pay you in advance. But you couldn't even do a Walmart to Walmart. You had no PayPal or bank account. So I had to pay you cash since your pockets are flat. And I still owe you money, right Dennis? But I only got hundreds in my pocket. Would you mind pulling out some change for that? <laughs> oh, wait. Wow. So besides what I gave you tonight, you don't even got money to eat? That's sad. And the thing, I was going to challenge him to go get a scone and a Earl Grey tea. Oh. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> I was gonna challenge you to go get a scone and an Earl Grey tea. Fuck, hold on, give me a second, I need some water. I'm not choking, I'm just fucking loose. I was gonna challenge you to go get a scone and an Earl Grey tea. And you boggle my mind how you could be so stupid yet pretend to know facts. We argued once, and he said, and I quote, it's not about money, it's about what your friends think. What kind of punk ass logic is that? <laughs> and please, explain this to me. No, no, no. So you mean to tell me you like cuddling in bed with your shirt off with the same dude you do two on twos with? That's <laughs> And don't try to lie now, because we're all seeing y'all. And by the way, Birdman Sandusky called. Say you want to sign all three of y'all. <laughs> hey, hey, and if that ain't bad enough, you should have seen this bitch in Tri-Cities. She was treating him like an angry mom. She wouldn't let him kick it in Emery's room because she said they had a scary bond. He finally worked up the courage to yell back at the bitch and said, no, he's my pal and we got a friendly bond. And I swear to God, she caught back her purse and hit him with that Barry Bonds. Okay? <laughs> she was like Superman. Cause she, hit it. she was like Superman. Cause she hit you with a bus, then a bed, and a futon. Hey, she was crying outside, but when we mopped up, he would be quiet. 
No, you can tell they felt crunchier than a crouton. <laughs> and, and what's sad is that she's gonna punk you in the making of your wife. Also, she can drain every bit of happiness that you will ever get in your life. And karma's a bitch. Cause you've gone nowhere. Even though you robbed us of every single opportunity. It's because of greedy, self-centered battlers like you that the rest of us don't have no fucking unity. And you've been at it for five fucking years. And you're just now getting on a GZ? You should've let the next man shine. So now God is using your mud bone bitch to punish you since you wasted our goddamn time. Damn. Time. Make some noise. Hey, make some noise for that ring, y'all. Hush all like. If me and my gang have to face issues, I don't have to bang pistols. I just have to pepper spray issues. If Northwest Battle Rap was the star world, you know who you Mace Whitney. <laughs> and, and still, like, hush, hush, like, fuck. I don't care what the skeptics say. It's practical, for example. If I need spicy food and I ain't got hot sauce, I can just use my peppers. See, you're extra gay. Never hit pop with your health. You're just on for the wealth. Good thing that I'm talking, stopping himself from copping the wealth, taking a step back with losses, and stopping his stocks to be built from his lies, squad, and the guilt, and he's fat. That's not going to help you. Long for the real. Shot for yourself, but it was blocked off, topped off to be in all talking, being in cognitive skill. Even this battle, I can sit back and say nothing, and you probably body yourself. I mean, You probably body yourself, but you know why I find the shit disturbing? Yo, are shooting shit and burning bridges, and that's why the shit's concerning. You're like twice the size of everybody, and you can never decide to be the bigger person. Get to learn. 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 Manage yourself. Make Get to learn it. Manage yourself. Make executives decisions. Remember, people at the top don't stoop low or worry about being the center of attention. But I knew this round there was trouble with ruin, so I saved this part officially for your slut of the moment. Hey. So I seen the girl and she's over. So I wouldn't fuck her ass at all. But I could use some head. <laughs> so if she offered, I'm not gonna pass it all. I mean, why would I say no? If she's gonna suck and grab my balls. First she'll grip and then chop the wood. That bitch lumberjacked me off. I said, but that bitch lumberjacked me off. And, and, and I'll get her to, <laughs> that bitch lumberjacked me off. I said, and she'll twerk with anybody. It's not hard to knock the bitch. She's on the quick, she'll take lots of dick. Be slurping anybody. Her box is sick, we call the bitch a arsonist. Cause she be burning everybody. But I can still have her do my dishes and she'll get on it. And I'll, I'll just crack her plates like tectonics and she'll buy new ones for me too. You can bet on it. I'll have the bitch make me a sandwich, then slap the bitch cause she forgot to put the respect on it. I said, I need mean, to go. Talk that sandwich shit. I said, I said, talk that bit of me sandwich shit. Hey, hey, talk that sandwich shit. Three dudes. I said, I said, I said, I said, I said, I said, but still, your whole woman. She be sending me nasty pics, she's so naughty. I have her getting down in the deal. I'm yo god, so prompt, you know. Elevate your soul promptly, you'll go zombie, no shoddy. I don't need to put the gun up and shoot triggers, no. I run up the fruit ninja, your whole body, get this whole off. Now your team always lose so often, I see your bros faulty. Your squad like your battle career, a whole bunch of no bodies, probably because the fucking tunes I hear from this dude are lame as fuck. You, you know it's fake as fuck, the crazy fucking fact that your team name is Night Game, but you're fucking always making some music that be lame as fuck. It ain't right, man, calling your squad Night Game if you aren't known for making cuts, you fat, shameful, lazy fuck. I mean, you fat, shameful, lazy fuck whoop his ass. That's what the hands have to do, this man passing through. I back, <laughs> smack him too, left straight hit him, and y'all see my box game spin him like Crash Bandy. Cool, you ain't nice with scrappy. 
fight for slapping. He's a dog on Nas, got this cross on Fox McGaugh and catch the right of passage. When I write a passage, it literally shows my right of passage. You nice, but otherwise, you wouldn't have a fight with cancer. Be polite, otherwise, be fighting after. Don't lose your head, otherwise, you might literally lose your head. That'll help you mind your manners. Woo. I said, Woo. and if, if, if for some reason, because your butter bean sauce and you still don't want, want to fuck with me, guy, I will backhand smack your fat ass man to since you double bean sauce. You're not fucking me. Oh. <laughs> Make some noise! Yeah. 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 Hey, make some noise for this battle. This was crazy ass battle. Hey,